So I just got the Withings Wi-Fi body scale, and I'm pretty excited about it. Um, it's really attractive. It's got this uh, mirrored finish, real thin. It's got a great industrial design. Um, but don't be fooled just by that. Uh, it actually has some really neat features that make this something to get excited about. It, if you listen to me closely, I said it was Wi-Fi, and that's the killer app, if you ask me. And that's what I was looking for when I picked this up. Uh, so what that essentially means is when you stand on this thing, it will take your weight, it will measure your body mass, and it will upload it uh, to the Withings uh, website where you can look at your data, your historical data over time, and uh, see beautiful charts and graphs. Um, some of the other neat things about this scale are that they have Apple and iPod integration. So um, I'll start with my... And it's not just... Uh, Apple, it's Android as well. I have an Android phone, and you can see that I can take a look and see, this is my data, this is the application, and let's see if I can get it to focus on it, and not me. Not clear. How about if I come close with it? There you go, you can see my crazy mug, but now at least this comes into focus. So there you go, so this is my weight, and I mean, so I can carry this around me and access all my data. I can actually spin this little wheel and go back and forth and see what's going on on different days. I can actually tilt this, which is kind of neat, and it will show me uh, my historical data, which obviously can be, you know, pinched and zoomed and all that good stuff. So I love that. And if you're a tablet owner, like I said, it'll work for the iPad as well. I think the iPhone, all those devices. Again, I'm a Android guy. So here we go. I got the, whoops. So there it is. There's the sideways look, and I got a lot of glare going on here, so I apologize for that. Let me get closer and see if I can get rid of that. But you can kind of see Mr. Shaky Cam is showing you all this uh, really cool graph. And again, uh, if I tilt it, um, you can see it's not really uh, designed. <laughs> you can see the camera taping itself. Great, recursive. Uh, is this upside down? It sure is. I have it upside down and it's not smart enough apparently to realize that. But it's still kind of cool to be able to have access to my data. It's the same application. Uh, it, it, it works for Android, but you know, obviously they haven't scaled it to fit the screen properly. But still, I'm not complaining. I think it's pretty cool. On top of that, we can actually go to uh, the website. And as you can see, um, this is my account on my Withings and I can see my data. And it looks very much like the Apple and iPhone and iPad um, application. You can uh, store multiple users. I, I have three. I have my, my family. I only, I'm a family of three. So we have, and, and that's pretty cool. It, it, it senses your, um, it senses who the user is just based on weight. And uh, so whoever's standing on it, it knows who they are. And it will upload, it to, upload their data to the site, which is really cool. Um, if there's a conflict, you can actually shift your weight. Like, let's say if there's two people in the house that kind of weigh about the same amount and it can't figure out who's who, it'll actually give you a couple choices and you can kind of tilt your weight and to select the right choice. Uh, and if, if that doesn't work for some reason, you can always go to the website and manually do it. But who wants to do anything manually? That's not why I bought it. So it's, it kind of does things on its own for the most part. Um, uh, another neat feature that I love about it is it, it integrates with other things. And in this case, like I'm using RunKeeper, which is an uh, Android app, which allows me to run. Oh, allows me to run. I run, and it records my. Uh, this is uh, this is not related at all to the Withings product, but um, I use RunKeeper. I'll jog. It'll use the GPS of my phone to determine uh, how fast I'm going, how many calories I've burned, my uh, my distance. And, you know, it automatically, because I'm into automation big time, it updates it to the RunKeeper website. So, you know, that could be annoying to check out your withings on, you know, your weight on one side and then manually enter it into RunKeeper. Well, withings was nice enough. Uh, they have great integration. They have APIs and all that stuff if you're a programmer. But you don't even have to be a programmer. They have a nice little feature here where you can actually um, click Share and you can export it to different things. You can get like the, um, different uh, feeds that you can post on other websites. And so essentially, as you can see, 
I have my weight here, and I don't have to do anything. Uh, it automatically pulls data from the Withing site using uh, the shared API, and uh, so it knows my weight, and that's that's really neat. Uh, Withings also has a blood pressure monitor. I don't really need that, so I didn't buy that. But that's kind of a cool thing if you're if you need to you know measure yours or someone in your family's blood pressure on a regular basis and want you want that track that also integrates with the uh, Withings website. All right, so for the sake of completion, I want to show you what the experience is like when you stand on the scale. So let's take a look at what the scale looks like in action. It takes a little time to zero in on your weight, but then once it gets it, it measures your weight and your body fat. Right now it's showing me my body fat and my BMI. You can see that it's got my username, Dad, on the top. So it detected me. And that's it. And, it, and now it's going to upload it to the website. And, uh, you know, you don't have to be around for that. The display shuts off. And that's pretty much it.